Hey, it's Brickzar. I want to do a quick update. First of all, to thank you. Thank everybody who's been watching the videos and buying from the Bricklink store. I know we've done a lot of these Pick It a Bricklink Lego orders lately uh, because we've sold a lot. In fact, I just looked at the last month and I've sold about, well, it's over $2,500 in a month, which is probably one of the best months I've ever had, especially when you consider that we're mostly just selling parts. So that has helped us out immensely, immensely. So I want to thank everybody for that. So, um, yeah, this is probably going to be my best year ever selling on BrickLink as far as by the end of the year what, what we sell. So I had to close the store this week. I was going to leave it open for the rest of the day. This is actually, I'm filming this on Monday, which is a holiday, which kind of stinks. I had four packages I needed to ship today, and they're, uh, the post office is closed. <laughs> they get a lot of holidays. So uh, those orders will go out, and uh, there's a couple of them that were some Pablos that will be uploaded, or they're uploaded, they just haven't posted yet, and then a couple of people got the uh, signed brick. I'm actually up to number, let's see, 39. Uh, Stefan Chervenkov got number uh, 39. Benji76 got 38. Brickzar got 37. I kept 37. I kept 37 for myself. These are so official. Um, <laughs> so, anyway, thank you, everybody. I just wanted to do this update just to let you know that the store is closed for about a week. I'm still at home. <laughs> we hadn't gone anywhere. We just got a lot of planning to do. Or not planning, a lot of prep work to do for the, uh, the wedding coming up. My wife has been... We're actually using, like, real plates at the reception and she needed something to put them in because we realized that when we're done the cardboard boxes might not be the best because we'll have to rinse the place off the plates off and they might be a little d damp so I, i'm using the plastic crates i did a video one time about the stuff that's in the plastic crates it's not the best storage solution i should have included that in my poppy max video that's another thing we used was the cr crates and actually the crates were part of the bricklink store at one time uh, they were actually numbered and I usually kept small sets in them, but now I need to go those to, to transport the plates to and from the wedding reception. So I got to go empty some. I'll show you the problem I have with that. So I had put all the crates back here in the in the back corner. It was just like, okay, I'm not going to need to get to this anytime soon. And I was trying to make use of the space. Oh, it's freed up the. I can almost get to the Duplo stuff now. And so she needs five more. <laughs> So I gotta reach. I gotta get these out and see what's in them. I think some of these got the base plates. I'll probably leave those and get some of the other ones that are behind here. So like this one had that. These are. I think some of these are just empty boxes of sets I've built already. Yeah, these are all empty boxes. And then this train set. So there's one. I'll just have to go find somewhere to put these. They might be brick stuff. Oh. Magic spin art. They even use this. Oh, this is one we never. This is not Lego, but uh, R2D2 Trouble Game. <laughs> and I decided to leave that one. It's got all the, the base plates, a lot of the older base plates in it. So this one actually does have some things that were in my store duplicates of uh, sets. They're not in my store now. Maybe I should go put them in the store, reprice these things. I'm pretty sure I kept out one each for my, my own collection. These little racer sets were actually pretty neat. Um, they're just not, some of these aren't practical to part out. So I usually keep them as whole sets. And then of course, all oh, the everybody's favorite Chima is in there. Wonderful. So, oh, I, gotta, I need to get these out. That one's really cool. Got that one. Got that one. That one. Oh, got two of those. And then all of these. Police car. Police car. These are most these 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 plastic containers are deceptive. It makes you feel like you're getting more because it's heavy, but 
you can tell that the most of the weight is the container. It's, it's like putting a poly bag in a giant container, oversized container. And everybody's favorite Chima speed oars. <laughs> oh goodness, what was I thinking? Uh, that's a terrible set. Another terrible one. And then another one of these. Oh look, got this. That's good. Probably one of the best things in here. And then the repair truck. Why is this in here? All right, so I've, I've freed up three. I'm trying to reach. I need two more crates. So gotta get this. Oh, Leah, yeah, everybody's favorite clone Peppa Pig. Uh, that's not even Mega Blocks. I got that because it was a train. I think that goes in there. And we've got this. Mega blocks thing because it looked like a train. I don't even know what that is. There's an elf set. I parted out these in my store. I don't know why I got it. I must have an extra one. Uh, just some random stuff here. These are some sets I needed to verify what parts I needed to finish them out. I'll just set these somewhere. Yeah, this is one of this is one of those Unitron sets. I really should try to complete this one out. There's only like four or five unit. Just threw everything in the floor. That's what I meant. But I'm just gonna set these somewhere. All right, I need one more tra uh, crate. All right, this is gonna be the easiest one. <laughs> just got a couple of classic sets. 10702. I just parted out some of these. I think. Or is this a different one? It's hard to tell with these. All right, so I got five more crates <laughs> for the stuff we're taking to the, the wedding and bringing back the plates and little things for the table and there's all kinds of stuff in there. <laughs> so uh, that so we're taking this week off. This is going to be like a, a week of not selling on BrickLink. I really would like to keep the store open, but between all that my wife has to do and then I have to go to work uh, the rest of the week, it's just, uh, we'll just keep it closed for now, but we'll be back open. I'll open it back up probably on the Monday uh, coming up a week from today. So thank you again. I want to thank everybody so much for supporting this. This has really helped me out immensely. Uh, we've had to buy the food. Uh, you've basically helped me pay for the food for the wedding, uh, for some of these uh, things, knickknacks and whatever my wife's organizing all that and that's why she hasn't she hasn't really had time to pick the order so it's worked out that I've been doing the Pablos because I've been doing the orders I apologize to a lot of you uh, <clears throat> particularly Bricks Bear she <laughs> Grits um, who else though Blockhead UK she <laughs> I was in such a hurry that a lot of times I would just go through and pick the orders and I really should have looked closer at the channel make sure who I'm picking the orders for and a lot of times these I realized after I pick the order like when I print the shipping label you know sometimes the when you print the shipping label it's not necessarily the, the actual person that placed the order it could be the husband it could be the wife it could be the parent name on the label instead of the person that actually placed the order but um, yeah sorry for all those that I messed up <laughs> who they were I messed up uh, some of these, what was in the order. I, I miscounted some of the things. So I, I owe, oh, um, another person I, I think I messed up their order was um, Rick Roly Poly. So I'm going to go back and try to figure out some of these. Some of you that I messed up the, the pieces you got, you got a store credit. So uh, check that out. And it was like, um, yeah, I made sure to do something that would cover shipping and um, the pieces. I mean, sometimes it's just like a couple of one cent or one or two cent pieces. But anyway, I make more mistakes than my wife. So I'll be glad when all this gets settled down and she can go back to picking the orders, which would mean there will be less Pablos because she's not going to come down here and do a Pablo for me. <laughs> I do the YouTube stuff. She does. She takes care of the house. That's <laughs> so anyway, that's all we're going to talk about for now. Close that drawer. I will be working on adding some more parts. We do have a few empty drawers. I did part out two or three sets. My son-in-law, I might as well go ahead and start calling that. He's going to be parting out some stuff that we'll be putting in the store. So we'll have completely full drawers, hopefully, uh, by the time the store reopens. But if I don't get the drawers full, it's 
because we're doing wedding stuff. Anyway, there's Chrissy. I gotta go. See y'all in the next video. Bye. You ready for the wedding, Chrissy? Chrissy?